Francesco. Now I know. You know? What do you know? Promise not to tell anyone? Yes, yes. All right, I promise, but you have to tell me. <laughs> it's heaven that holds up the earth. It's true. This is our secret. Don't tell anyone, okay? I swear it. Sure? My father says he eats children. Not oh, Pietro, that's not true. Don't believe it. Well, anyway, we're here now, so we can't go back. Come here. <gasps> Are you all here? Yes, we're all here. Sure, are you scared now? Sit down on the bench. Frightened, eh? I don't eat children. I know. You tell stories. Magic stories. Oh, you're brave. Guys, forget the stories. That one will eat all five of us in just one bite. First, I made the light. Too better to see what I was doing. I didn't lose any time. Then I made the stones to dance on them with my feet. Then I made the clouds to wash myself with the rain. Then I made the wind <sighs> to tickle my back. But since I was feeling lonely then, I made the animals to roam free in the world. And then they made my heart happier. Then I made man. I regret doing it. He betrayed me. So I put my offended soul into a deer, the immortal keeper of peace of the woods, and I ran away and hid among the ferns and the fog of the forest. And since man invented war to destroy other men and nature,
rooting for whoever arrives first at the tap. Make it 20. Count me in. Me too. Your money would be better used to become a notary, Pietro. Ha, I'll use yours for that. <laughs> Besides this time, my only thought now is hunting. Yes, and I know what you're after. They're all two legged with long hair. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> ah, here are my it's twenty duty, and here are mine. Hey, hey no, just a minute. minute. Let's, Let's bet, bet them, them again. again. On what? Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Look at the horse. Look at the guy. The snake. Get out of here. Today you're marvelous. Today you're marvelous. There's a whole new world to discover. Put him on the table. Over here. Hurry. Bring him in here. If someone tells you the loyal deer doesn't exist, I'll shove a blade in their water. heart. Hurry up. I've been hunting for months, and what do I get? A deer at the end of its life. It was foggy. Suddenly we heard a noise. How did this happen? We, he ran into the woods, and when I found him, he was already down in a pool of blood. That deer is a creature of the devil. Uh, 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 uh. I'll say it again, something. that deer is a Listen. creature of the devil! Devil! He's dead, the poor thing! Devil! We will get him.
chance. I knew it. You lost the chance. How was that possible? You had it in your sight, right in front of you. You did that on purpose. What are you talking about? Yes, you missed it on purpose. We've been here for days. Eating unthinkable things. In the cold and humidity. And so? And we had at least gotten him. Now, when are Come we going to get him guys? again? Letting him run away <sighs> like that. How could you do that? Every day. It's dangerous. Aren't you scared? You're the one who scares me. I had always hoped to meet you alone. To talk to you. Like we used to do once, when we were children, remember? Of course I remember. So tell me. But here. It's sad here. And why tempt contagion without a reason? Isn't a man who suffers reason enough? It's heaven that holds up the earth. Do you remember? You told me that. So then you didn't forget our secret. I'm here, Giovanni. These bandages need changing. Tomorrow I'll bring some new ones. Beautiful lady. You are here. No, I mean for days and days we were following his tracks. Maybe they're right. That animal is not earthly. Francesco never fired a wrong shot. If I had shot at it, the deer would be lying there next to you and we would have put an end to the myth. Now, yes, I don't doubt it. <laughs> bravo, bravo. Fool around. However, remember that I'm not coming hunting anymore. Come on, Bernardo. You exaggerate too much. Let huh? me be. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Well, then, this evening, to ask your forgiveness, I'm taking all of you to... To the Taverna de Contabaki. Yes! We're getting off with very little. But you're paying. I'm paying. I'm paying. I'm paying. For everyone. Francesco. For everyone. All right, then. It's all right. Francesco! It's war! Riots have exploded in the city. They're wounded. We're fighting. The people are rebelling against the nobility. Faberon and the others are escaping. It's the revolt. Soldiers, keep this bomb away! Let's get torn out! 
soon we'll have back everything that's ours. Where's Joe? Long live the people of the sea, Joe! Let's get you back to the free world! Gubbio, 20 Scooby. Except for the Weaver, 15. Even my workers are indebted to me. Thus think that Rufino still owes me the 30 Scooby that he needed for his ailing son. Aren't you worried about anything that's happening? How can you be so calm? Calm? Not at all. I will send my son Francesco far from here until things quiet down again. This merry-go-round will end soon, and the city will have to pay a very high price. We have to be ready for what comes later. Keep a firm grip on our monies. You can rest assured everyone will need it when this is all over. I'm asking you to listen to me. To listen to me, not as the son of your employer, but as your fellow citizen. I can't believe that the echo of this commotion didn't enter here, here inside you. What happened today changes our destiny forever. There is a revolt outside. The whole city is running to take arms in the defense of freedom. Because today we are all equal. All sons of Assisi. Now, for the first time, the future is in our hands. It's like a dream. A dream that's now a reality. We just have to have the courage to defend it. The privileges. What's happening? The injustices that the nobles forced the us to endure still. until yesterday are now part of the past. What are they doing down there? It's your city that calls you. Fight for her. The nobles that we chased out of here hired a group of mercenaries. And they're marching against the Sisi. Against us. Can't you see that? Our victories need to be defended. With the sword, we all need to defend her. A Sisi needs you. Don't leave her alone. For one day you will no longer be Humble workers. But citizens who fight for freedom. You, Rufino, are you with us? I want to be, Master, but I cannot. I have a sick son. If I go to war, who will take care of him? And you, Antonio? You've already fought. Your experience will be useful to us. Don't ask this of me, I beg you. Your son Paolo is with us. Do you want to leave him alone? That's enough! Father, the city needs all of its men. I'm let me through. These are my men. I'm the one who pays them. Fighting for freedom is worth much more than money. Not more than life, my son. It's too heavy for you. You would have fallen at the first shot. This stays here. Father covers you with gold. 
All of you say it too. It literally lets you swim in gold. And how do you thank him? By being a rebel. You want to chase out the nobles, go to battle. <laughs> Hurry and grow up instead. All of you, get back to work. Who's with me? Who's with me? I am. I am with you. Whoever crosses that threshold has lost his job. You've decided. Mother. Don't go. I must. Respect my wish, at least you. How can a mother respect a wish that puts her son's life in danger? I beg of you. I know I can ask you for the impossible. You dream of a world that doesn't exist. May God protect you. Francisco, what will happen after this war? Now after we win, the people will govern the CC. I like to do this most of all. When you're in front of the enemy, you look at him right in the eyes and it's your life against his. And you ask why? Why should God be on my side? Why should he guide my sword and not his? This is why we have to be the strongest, to not depend on God. We all depend on God. I want to fight too. War is not a game for children. I'm not a child. I demand it. I want to fight by your side. Ah, don't fight that anymore. Bernardo, enough. Stop. Paolo is coming with us. Now let's hurry. We have to join the army. You are a knight, too. Hurry up, let's go. We're late.
pass through here. Oh, 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 oh,
Good morning, Teobaldo. Welcome back to Assisi. Thank you. It's a city that thanks you. Your return means law and order for all of us. And you are kind. We have to take inventory of what they stole from me, those cursed animals. I want to be repaid every last scudo. And you... You were with them, no? Answer. You fought against me. The war is over. Of course it's over, and you were the ones who lost. Fine. Give work to the revolters, Moltari Teobaldo. Pietro, he's an excellent worker. He's a capable young man, intelligent. And he comes from a good family besides. That's what you'd say. He didn't ransack your home. He didn't steal your money. Isn't that true? You only think about what you lost. But you know we lost something too. What did you lose? You. My best friend. Francesco. Pietro Di Bardoni's son. Let's go. All of you. What are you doing here? Unload those things. Get moving. Come with me, Tilman.
do it. I need more bandages. More bandages? Yeah, more bandages. I have no more now. Yes, but you saved the man. from the battle against Assisi. The prisons of Perugia are full of those traitors. Open the cell. Which then is in charge? Hey, Master C. Escaped from Pisa. First, he took refuge with the others in Lyon and came back with them, intending to head for Rome. Where's your book? Which books? I don't, I don't have any books. I don't know what you're talking about. Look all over. That's enough. You take care of it. You don't scare me. Hold it, Hold it still. I'm not afraid of pain. To be fair, I'm not afraid. Of your cruelty will come back to you. Whatever you do to one of your brothers, you do to God. I'm not afraid. You don't scare me. You don't scare me. Come on. Get come off on. me. Come on. This way. Come out Get off me. This way. God will punish you. Ah. Ah. you too. Who was that man? A wise man. Or a mad man. You figure it out. He wanted to go to the Pope. And who are you? My name is Leone. But I'm a lost sheep. I won't be here much longer. Is this the book they were looking for? Yes. But it's written in the vernacular. It's the gospel. 
about the gospel written in the vernacular. Finally, I can understand it, too. That book changed my life. It speaks a language that I can understand. And it says things I believe in. When I get out of here, I know which path to follow. In the gospel, it was said, you will love thine neighbor and hate thine enemy. But I say to you, love thine enemies, pray for those who persecute you. Until they are sons of thy father who art in heaven. If you don't convert, if you don't become like a small child, you won't enter into the kingdom of heaven. If you don't become like small children, you won't enter into the kingdom of heaven. If you want to be perfect, go and sell all of your belongings, distribute them to the poor, and you will have a treasure in heaven. Sell your belongings, distribute them to the poor, and you will have a treasure in heaven. Don't accumulate treasures on earth, but accumulate them in the kingdom of heaven, there where you can find your treasure. You will also find your heart. No one can serve two masters. Thus you can't serve God in heaven and the God of money. Money buys and annuls brotherhood among men. Don't torment yourself saying, what will we eat and what will we drink? What will we wear? Your heavenly Father knows what you need. Look with your heart. Look with God's kingdom and his justice before anything else. Look with your heart. And all these things will be also given to you. In truth, I tell you, if you don't become like a small child, you don't want to create worries for tomorrow. You won't enter into the heaven's kingdom, because tomorrow will take care of itself. Each day presents its own worries. Distribute to the poor. Sell all your belongings. Place your faith in the Lord. If you won't be as small children, He will take care of you. The heart of these people has hardened. Their ears don't listen. They've closed their eyes to no longer see with their eyes. To no longer hear with their ears and not to understand with their heart. This is so, brother. We need to look with the heart. Look with the heart. But how do we look with the heart? You must love all things you set your eyes on. And if what I set my eyes on is unjust and impure? The important thing is that you look upon them be pure. Not anyone, the Lord tells me. But he who does the will of my Father who art in heaven will enter into the kingdom of heaven. And then Jesus said, In truth I tell you, if you don't convert, if you won't become as small children, you won't enter into the kingdom. Leone! Leone, do you hear me? Leone! There's a man following us. Don't turn around. Walk fast. Come on, let's go.
isn't she, Ara? Yes. Leave her be, or I'll call the guards. You're pretty. Just as he said. Who are you talking about? Answer me. A person. Which person? I met him in prison in Perugia. Tell me his name, I beg you. Francesco. Then he's alive. I don't know for how much longer. captive in the prisons of Perugia, but he's in danger. You must do something right away. Francesco is alive. Prison has been Francesco's body, but not his soul. Every day, regardless of humiliation and continuous abuse from his jailers, he finds comfort to go on living in the gospel. Hate no longer lives in his heart. You who see and hear everything. your infinite pity, you who saved his soul, save his life as well. Was waiting for you. Save them. Save them also. My son.
How are you? As soon as we knew, we came running. We missed you. Now rest and think about getting stronger. You know, Francesco? I took the vows. I'm about to become a priest. Soon Bernardo will also be here. I received his news. He is returning from the Crusades. Francesco. Make them be quiet. Make them be quiet. their eyes to not see with their eyes, to not hear with their ears, and to not reason with their hearts. Totally In truth I tell you, love thine enemies, pray for those who persecute you. My God, God of all things, not anyone he tells me, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven. But he who does my Father's will, thy will be done. If you want to be perfect, go. Sell all your belongings, distribute them to the poor, and you will have a treasure in heaven. Look with your heart. Sell all your belongings. Distribute them to the poor. And you will have treasure in heaven. Sell all your belongings. Why are they ringing? It's another war. against God. Make them stay quiet. Keep them quiet. Why are they ringing? Why? Thank you very much. Oh, good morning. I came to buy some materials from you. I want to see Francesco without his knowing it. I understand. Oh, uh, come, come. The best materials are in the storeroom. I think he's a bit better. The fever is going down. Let's hope he gets better soon. Francesco! Where is he? Francesco!
broke the bell. What happened? Everyone okay? Oh my gosh. It's broken. It's broken. He broke the bell. And now what will I tell the bishop? The bell was brought in from Florence. It cost the township hundreds of scudi. Ah, oh, hundreds of scudi. Hundreds of scudi. Here is the fruit of your madness. Oh, all right. All right, I will pay for this cursed bell. The city must not worry. Pietro Bernardone has always paid his debts. But you, you, do you hear me? Come down or I'll get you myself. Terrible things, Chiara. Things that make you doubt everything. That make you wish for death. The perfume of the flowers of the earth. I had almost forgotten that life can also be just this. It's as though I never lived. And we're living now for the first time. Do you hear it? What is it, Francesco? Do you hear it? What? In that tree. It's an owl. I hear it. Listen. I hear the sound of his breath. Do you remember when we were children? Everything was a surprise. The rain, the stars. My father's men. If they see us together, it's over. Go now, Francesco! Hurry! Run! Run, Francesco! Hurry! Go ahead! What is it? <laughs> Nothing, my master! Keep looking! In the woods! Keep looking in the woods!
You. Stay away! You're alive! Please, stay away! Don't come any closer! No! Get away from me! No! Don't touch me! Don't touch me! You'll have to abandon your house! And your riches! You'll be forced to live in a world of people in despair! You'll be the last among the men! Go away! Paolo de Gubbio, 20 scudi. Giuseppe the Weaver, 15. Even my workers are indebted to me. Rufino still owes me the 30 scudi that he borrowed for his ailing son.
Here. Oh, thank you. Thank you, sir. More. Take them. Just more. Give it to me. More. There's Take me. Give me money. Give me some it's money. Oh, God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Back off. It's mine. Give it to me. It's mine. Give it to me. Hey, 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 it's mine. Give it to me. Put that to me. Give me the money. Give me the money. Give me the Give me the money. Give me the money. Give me the money. Give me the money. Give me me Right. Right. Uh, right. Right for whom? For everyone, everyone in need. For my father. I, I, I am your father. I am your father. I am your father. I, I, I am your father. Francesco, Francesco, how do you feel? Fine. I feel fine. Are you sure? Yes, my friends. I'm fine. Why are you looking at me that way? Don't you believe me? Francesco, don't you see what's happened to you? What used to be bitter is now sweet. What is he saying? Why did you give your father's money away? Nothing that we have belongs to us. But it was enough if you, if you gave a fistful of money and they would have been content. That would have been enough to send them away. But I don't want to send them away, Pietro. I want to stay by their side. But Francesco, you can't. That's him. There he is. Take him away. Come with us. Come with us. Us. Walk. Us. Walk. Us. Walk. I want to be one of them. I want to be one of them! One of them! I want to be one of them! Leave! Well Let's said! Let's get inside! Leave, leave! We need to be pulled out! Stealing from the house! Squander the work of a lifetime! Did you ever work? Silence! Oh. You know what fatigue means? Shame on you! Please. Shame on you! Coward! You'll burn in hell! Repent! Repent! I wanted him to become a man who respects the rules and is respected by all. Please. Please. I taught him love for every form of art Please. and for the arts. I provided him with the rarest of fish and the most precious of clothing. Why all of this? So he could stand out among the other young men. So that he could become better than me. Take my name outside this city's walls, out into the world. And instead, instead, I've raised a thief. 
Our hopes for our sons are not always well answered. Everything. You took everything from me. Not only well, the materials say. of the money, but also my pocket. Because of money I saw, people reduced to misery. Families evicted from their homes. Children at the end of their lives. You're a thief. You need to justify yourself so that you're penitent and instead you reproach me. And me? What fault have I, my son? None. Mother. You have been the sweetest of all mothers. But now another mother awaits me. Her name is Lady Poverty. From now on, let him be your little Francesco. Why did you do this? What is it that you want? I want to live with simplicity. I want to return to the ground. The ground used to build houses for the poor. And the paths leading out into the world. It will be me who will finish in the ground through your fault. But I won't permit you to squander everything. Years and years of sacrifice. You will no longer be my heir. Here. Is this your wealth? Take it back. I don't need it any longer. It serves me no longer. Is this... Is this the wealth, Your Eminence? But this is an insult! It's a scandal, Your Eminence! It's the work of a demon, there is no doubt. Is this... Is this what wealth means for you? Is this? Is this your wealth, is it then? Keep it. What's he Keep doing? It. What is he doing? It's yours. Go back home. It's yours. Back home, I said. Take it. Take it. Go ahead. Keep it. Have you no shame? Elia. You wanted to meet Francesco. Now you see who he is with your own eyes. The best of us. Now I have nothing more. The man has no shame. My wealth disgusts you to this degree. I will be rich in another way than you. I will be rich for all that I will lose. Don't you know what you're saying is that you've lost all reason? You can't be rich without money. 
because everything has a price. It's not true. It's not true. God doesn't. God doesn't. The purity to which you aspire is not of this world. But I, I'm not seeking purity. I want to live among... The impure. Those forgotten by all. The humiliated. I don't wish to help them. I want to... I want to live as them. As a rag picker. As a pauper. As a dog. A stray dog. Look at it. As a madman who's kicked. Who's mocked. And who laughs? A jester! A jester! Yes, I want to be God's jester! <laughs> to renounce everything could be a moment's choice, but to transform it into everlasting choice, that is impossible. However, we are only here to verify the risk of heresy. I looked everywhere for you. You found me. Listen, Francesca. I spoke to your father. He says that he's willing to forget what happened if you come home. Huh? This is my home, Bernardo. No, these are ruins. It is the house of God, and I must restore it. Francesco, listen. Do you want to ruin your life to rebuild a small country church? Where no one will ever enter, don't you understand? But only now does my life make any sense. What sense? What sense? Francesco. Francesco, look at me. Please, let's go. Let's do what we've always dreamed about. Ride our horses around the world. Conquer new lands, all of us together like a Why conquer what we already have? Look, Bernardo. Look. Everything we need is already ours. What else do you need? What else do you require, Bernardo? <laughs> You're crazy. I don't want to listen to you any longer. Let's go, Pietro. <laughs> Oh, 
bread. A piece of bread. I'm hungry. Please, I beg you. Is this what you want? Take it. This is what you want. I it. It's these. Come, take them. Take them. Is this what makes you happy? Come and take it. Here, what did you take it. Take all. Come. It's gold. It's gold. Do some for everyone. Hey, that's gold. Silver. Take it all. Take it all. Here. Take it all. Here. Take it all. Gold. Silver. It's all yours. All of you. Here. Here. Take it. Take it. All of you. Is this what you want? Bring it to his grave. Take it. Isn't this happening? Yes. Francesco was right. This is what you want. This is all you care about. So take it. Take it. I don't need it. Get off me. 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 Get way to win the day. Oh, yes. This time I Thank agree you. with you, brother. I'm dying of hunger. Here. For you. Praise God. Mm. Mm. It's almost better than a stuffed pheasant. Mm. Come. <laughs> Peace be with you. Thank you, sir. You don't have to thank me. Thank this you, bread is for everyone. I'm so hungry. Eat up, children. It's good, isn't it? Eat, eat. Goodbye, pheasant. Wait, brothers. Take some. Come on, here. Take it. Here. God bless you. Thank you, Lord, for having made me the instrument of your infinite chair. Okay. Lower. A little lower. Thank you, Lord, for letting me be a better head carpenter than Brother Bernardo. Thank you, Lord, for giving me the gift of patience with Brother Pietro. <laughs> Thank you, Lord, for all of this. Pull it up!
back is in pieces, brothers. I've never felt so tired. Oh Lord, hear my prayer. Help my shoulders to not cave in. Help my legs not to buckle. Help my voice not to crack. Help me, Lord, to be the instrument of your peace. And allow it also, Lord, that there be someone to hear us. That our words not be spoken only for the wind. Please hear our voice, Lord. They're not even opening up. How can we invite them to pray with us? Brother, tomorrow we're opening the doors of our church. Come. Go away. All of you, go away. Do you have some bread, no, sister? I we only need a little. God bless you. No, I said, I have nothing. Go hey, away. Please be with you. Please, sir, anything. Go away, I said. Please, sir. Your father is here, too. Please, come inside. Let's talk. We have so much to tell each other. Your father also has much to tell you. Come in. I'll have them prepare something. Come, go in. We just need a bit of bread. Francesco, what have you done to your hands? We restored a small church where the poor and the unfortunate will feel. We're here to announce it to everyone, to invite you to join us at filling it with prayer and hymns. It's sad. It's a deserted church. Oh, Francesco, enough dreaming now. Do you think anyone will listen to you if you're dressed in rags? Come inside. I'll find a way. It's a small church right outside the walls. It's the church of the poor. There we will share what we have and pray. Together we will sing the praises of the Lord with heads held high. Since the Lord is present in every creature and everything in the world, don't be ashamed of your condition. You're not at fault if you're poor. The Lord is in heaven, but also Look, in our bare hands, in our bare feet, in our ragged clothing. The kingdom of heaven is for the last ones. Trust in God and pray together with us. Therefore, we pray in the language that we use every day. Our Father, Our Father who art in heaven, who art in heaven. Hallowed be thy name. Hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom thy come. Kingdom thy come. will be done. Thy will be done. On earth as it is in heaven. On earth as it is in heaven. Is in heaven. Give us this day. Give us this day. Our daily bread. Our daily bread. Our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses. And forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass forgive against those who us. Trespass and lead us not into temptation. And lead us not into temptation. But deliver us from evil. And but deliver us from evil. From evil. For thine is the For thine kingdom. Is the, kingdom. The, power the, glory. And the power and the glory. This is too much. Throw them God out. Is Lord. They are disrupting the mass. God is Lord. Did you hear? Throw them out. This absurd disease is ruining our youth. Oh, please. Soldiers, stop her. Francesco, please. Go away. Stop. Go away. Bring my daughter inside. Go away. Oh. Leave us alone. No. Go away. Stop. Jesus. Francesco. Chiara, take her away. Chiara. Get inside the church. Go inside. Oh, baby. Let's go. Let's go. 
Sheriff! Stop it! You're Princess hurting them! Pietro. Francesco. So this is how you've learned to look with your heart? Leone. Yes. I've learned to love everything that I set my eyes upon. <laughs> but what are you thinking? You've become the scandal of the city. Listen, Francesco. I will speak with the bishop. I'll tell him to accept you among the Novidiates. In the end, wouldn't it be the best thing to do? But I want to live in the streets. Among the people. Preaching outside the church is not acceptable. But I don't want to stay outside of the church. I came here to ask for your help. We need a priest to celebrate the Mass. In our little church, we repaired the one that's outside of the walls. You'll come, won't you? There's no one to be seen, brother. It's not one son. I told you so. No one will come. We were mistaken about everything. That's not true, Pietro. We weren't mistaken. They are making a mistake by not coming to church. What's happening? Pietro, why are you putting them out? Because we don't need them, Francesca. It's useless. No one is coming. Let's sing and pray. Let's begin. Have faith. The Lord hasn't abandoned us. Come, brothers, enter. They were right, Francesca. More are on their way. Come, enter. Come closer. The Lord heard us. <laughs> I can't believe it. It's a miracle. This is amazing. Don't be afraid. He is our brother, too. Where is she? Answer me! Where did she go? She's gone to him. Speak! Speak! Yes! <laughs> Let's go.
This is the body of Christ. Accept the body of Christ with all your hearts. I ran away. I couldn't stay in that house any longer. What will you do now? I want to be like you, like all of you, be a part of your family, to pray to the Lord, to vote myself to him, to be poor among poor. place our trust. In you, we place our destiny. You are our hope, our patience, our strength. Holy and just Father, Lord King of heaven and earth, you are the Father of all creatures. You are our Father. You are love, perfect love, and we must love our neighbor just as you do. Omnipotent, Holy and great, guide our path. Lord, help us to keep our eyes open. Help us to listen and to understand with our heart. Help us to love for you, Lord. For you, Lord. need to be strong. They will try and stand in the way of your living your life freely. Never will anyone force me to renounce something that I feel within myself. Now I am as you are. For the first time I am truly at peace. God is in me. As he is in all things in this world. Francesco, your father's coming. Take her away from here. You must hide her. Leon and I will stay here. Take me to the San Paolo Monastery. You must hide her! They're coming! They're there, in that church. Lord. Lord. Make us into your humble servant. Make us into your humble servant. The instrument of your peace. The instruments of your peace. In you we place our destiny. We reject our destiny. We, place our destiny. we take back our destiny. Give us the strength. Give us the strength. Give us strength. Give us strength to deal with adversities. To deal with adversities. Peace and good tidings, brothers. Peace and tidings. Where is my daughter? Your daughter's not here. Francesco, we lost the way. Nobody knows where we are anymore. Don't fear. You'll see that God will help us to find it again. But can't we stop? Just no, enough we can't time to stop. rest. No, we cannot stop. Please, Lord, welcome my sinner's soul. Please, Lord, welcome my soul as a sinner. Listen, As I'm asking you for the last me. time. Where is Chiara? Brother, what are you doing? You're killing a person just to know that... Francesco is accompanying Chiara to the monastery in San Paolo.
Brother Wind. Thank you. For coming to our aid, thank you. To show us the way. That's where we need to go. Come, brothers. But there's no path there. Not yet. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Chiara, how are you feeling? And you, brothers? Very well. Thank you, Lord. The monastery. We've arrived. Oh. Chiara. I feel fine. Don't worry. Sit down. Sit down. I can walk. It's nothing. It doesn't hurt. Come. I miss you so much, Francesco. You will always be with me while I take God's word into the streets of the world. And you will be by my side in this peace, in this silence, when I gather myself in prayer. Your voice will guide me whenever I feel lost. You'll never feel lost, Francesco. I came to take my daughter back. What does this mean? You can't touch her anymore. She has devoted herself to God. You. It was you. You will pay for this. In the name of God, obey the will of the bishop that I represent here. <laughs> Do you know what it means to lose a daughter? Do you know what it means for a father to know that she's dressed in rags? Starving, numb from the cold, willing to throw away 
Her marvelous life. Her youth. I know. I can read it in your eyes. But Chiara's choice for a husband is the best that you could ever hope for. Now, she is the bride of God. What you have done is unacceptable. It will not be tolerated again. The bishop can no longer protect you. I came here purposely to tell you. I see these youth are confused by your words, by your behavior. There are exact rules that we must honor, and you as well. If you want to preach, you need to join a religious order. An order. But I don't want an order. I just want to live in poverty. You can if you choose to exist as a hermit. Hermits are allowed both poverty and solitude. I don't want to live in solitude. I want to stay in the world, together with my brothers. All things are impossible. They led to heresy. It's not true. It's not true. It's not true. If Christ, Son of God, in order to bring us the word of his Father, and thus give us eternal salvation, embraced every type of suffering, hunger, thirst, cold, humiliation, betrayal, spit, What else is left for we mortals, if not to follow his example as much as possible? What is left? I've never seen him this way before. If you're not convinced, try talking to the Pope. The Pope is the only one on earth who can authorize such a thing. The Pope? But I warn you, the Pope is of great and unequivocal faith. You will pay dearly for your error if he deems your request as offensive. Even with your life. Oh Lord, Lord, my God help me. Tell me what I must do. Show, show me which path I must take. Give me a sign. Give me a sign. I beg you. I beg you, Lord. He can't tell help me what you. I must do. No one can. Lord, my God, please. You must find the answers from within. Help me. Help me. I feel lost, Lord. Lord, my God, my God, God of all things. Help me, help me, Lord. Oh, God, Lord, help me. Oh, God, help me. I implore you. Help me, Lord. 
Help me. Help me. Help me. Illuminate my heart with your light. Help me. Help me, Lord. <laughs> Wake up, Silvestro. Pietro, Bernardo. Maceo, come on. Wake up. Simon, up, up, come on. Wake up, come on. Well, let's go. Where are we going? Let's go, no? Let's go. Holiest Father, I ask for your benediction. Holy Father, I come to ask for your permission to live the gospel to the letter. My brothers and I wish to celebrate a pact with Lady Poverty and travel around the world, spreading the word of the Lord. We will welcome the brigands with love, and we will consider as our princes, the beggars, and the lepers. This is a dream, my son. Many of us in our youth dreamed of these ideals. But life placed us with our feet on the ground. We don't possess wings. Man is made of clay. Francesco, son of Assisi, can you explain how you would feed those two thousand souls? Until today, the Lord has fed me and my few brothers. Why couldn't he do the same tomorrow? Whether we are two hundred or even two thousand. How many millions of birds fly in the sky and are fed by the Lord? 
Does our highest one have a limit? How many millions of stars shine in the sky? Isn't it the highest one who lights them each night? The gold you suggest is too great for man. Too great. Your Holiness, Father the Saint, if we really say that the path shown by the Gospel cannot be achieved, then I ask you... I humbly ask you... What is the purpose of the Church? No, what is this? Heresy, I say! These words Why can't we spread the Gospel's no, word to the poor? No, What's the significance of having a church if we can't spread the word? We all work in the name of Jesus Christ. We're doing nothing wrong. Sanctity! 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 Francesco, Francesco, you knew this was an impossible task. What did you go and say to him? You're crazy! I just asked to live the gospel. The gospel. How can the Pope not understand one who wants to live the gospel? Shh. What kind of Pope is this? Whatever kind of church is this? Francesco, I beg you to stop. Why didn't he listen to my words? They were simple words after all. Why? Why? Why did he close his heart? Why did he close it? Maybe I made a mistake. Where did I go wrong? Where? 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 Where did I go wrong? Where? Did... Where? <laughs> Watch where you walk. Rock a muffin. You're not the only one here. Hi, handsome. Well then. Come, my love. That's right. Sit here. Taste how good it is. A poor woman lived in the desert. She was beautiful. The king saw her and was dazzled by all her beauty. 
fell in love. And they had sons. The children grew by their mother's side. One day she called them and said, I have nothing to take away your hunger. Go to the city, to the king. The sons went to him. When the king saw them, he felt his heartbeat grow stronger. But he didn't know why. Who are you? He asked. We are the children of a poor woman who lives in the desert, they replied. The king, overcome by a strong emotion, came down from the throne and embraced them. And he said, You, you are the inheritors of my kingdom. The first places to my right and left are reserved for you. Be content. I am that mother. And I bring you your son's holiness. grow, and I stifled it. I stifled it with all my strength. I wanted to unite the East and the West in peace. I wanted, wanted to look into the eyes of the Sultan, embrace him, and instead I had to move armies against him. I wanted to be a saint, and I discovered that I was a man full of weakness. to be Pope. There is no one who is lonelier on this earth. The entire world comes to us. But we, who can we go to? Poor is the Pope that, that doesn't lean on God. God never abandons his children. You can't know how many times I prayed to the Lord that he send me someone to show me the way. You can't know how many nights I cried because that way was no longer to be found. At times it can be better to light a small light than to hurl abuse against the darkness. I had a dream yesterday. The large columns of this church were shaking. They were swaying like palm trees. A whole building was about to collapse, but suddenly a man appeared at the bottom of the colonnade. He leaned his slight shoulders against the walls, and he held them up. He prevented the church from collapsing. I went closer to see who it was. And step after step, I saw it was someone. Someone in rags. Tattered. 
the last of men. When I finally arrived in front of him, I looked at him and I... I recognized who it was. It was you. It, it was you. God heard me. Pietro, could you stop doing that? Oh, Lord. Look at my soul. And make it free. As free as these little brethren of mine. Let me see the world with their eyes. What is he doing? Teach me to love with the simplicity and naturalness of their flight. Teach me to be light. Light and never arrogant in judging the things of the world. There, my brothers. Here's your mother. Oh, Lord. Teach me to fly on high among the hills, among the treetops, the stars held up by the wind of your love. <sighs> How strange. What, what are you doing? Lord, God of salvation, let my cry reach you like the melodious song of the birds, bringing love, joy, and happiness. Because you, you are love, joy, and happiness. You are happiness. You are beauty. Come and see. The life. You are the key. You are the strength of my soul. You. You are the peace of my soul. The peace of my soul. Let's sing. Let's sing together. Let's sing of their joy. So many birds, how beautiful. Let's sing. <laughs> how beautiful. Let's sing. Let's all sing. Let's sing together. Let's all sing together. Mama, come and see. Let's sing together. Look, he's talking with the birds. Brother Crow. Brother Owl. Sister Lux. Let's sing. Let's sing. Everyone sing. Sing. Let's praise the Lord that our prayers may reach Him among the ranks of saints as a prayer for all the lost brothers, for those who struggle to find the way, for the poor. Let me through. Let me through. For those, for those who never had anything. 
for those who suffer, for those who are ill, for our brothers, the lepers. Blessed are you among all men. <laughs> for those who love us, and for those who hate us, for all, in the same way, we will raise up, we will raise up our song of joy. Be with you, Brother Paolo. Death will be sister to whoever has closed his eyes in the name of the Lord. suffering and his courage. Many things would not have happened. Be proud of him. <laughs> brought us together again. I'm not alone. that you're here, Father. It's uh, very peaceful. Yes. There is peace. I uh, know that you were received by the Pope. He heard me. I didn't hear you well enough. approval consecrated what was already in our hearts. Now we can spread God's word among the people with the same simplicity as water. I know that many are rushing to hear your sermons. We are all children looking for a father. We are ready, Francesco.
What are you doing with these knapsacks? We don't need them. They have no purpose. Put, put them down. Leave them here. What more do we need than what we have? We don't need anything else. Do you know how to whistle? Uh, I don't know. Try it. Uh, I, I can't do it. Come on, try again. You too, Bernardo. Come on. Joyfully, you can do it. That's it. I think this helps more than the staff. I don't think this will help protect me from the dangers between here and Britain, though. Francesco is right. What would a trip be without dangers? I will calm the Teutons with the gospel. Maceo. Francesco said to mouth the whistle, not to play on it. Lord, protect my brothers from hunger and sickness, from the cold and ice, from solitude and from hate. Many seasons have passed, Lord, since the day in which my brothers and I left. We traveled the world far and wide to bring your word and your message of peace. We arrived exhausted. Those men were asking questions that we couldn't understand. We knew too little of the idiots. At times they welcomed us. Other times they threw us out. Some died. Some lost their way. But what comforted those of us who continued his walk was the fact that at times we heard news of new brothers rushing to live in happiness and freedom. I went to the Orient to try and stop the war that bloodies those lands. The Sultan received me. He heard me. Peace is the highest of tasks, he told me. But the power to impose it was not in his hands. I prayed, Lord. And I will pray until this power be given to someone. A brother met up with me in the Holy Land. He told me that confusion now reigns where we began our walk. I didn't tell him that my eyes are tired, that my body has been put to the test. I came back. I pray to you, Lord, to please give me the strength to go on. To reduce the difference in height between the roofing and the walls. The frescoed walls are going to be arches. magnificent. Something never seen before. Note The structure will need to be well reinforced to support the weight of the bell. But will the bell tower stand? Can we see the bell? Yes. Brother Tommaso, do you want to uncover it? It would be an imposing structure. Wait to hear how it sounds. It was founded in Guido Paisano's workshop. It's beautiful. We'll need other materials for a new scaffolding along the west wall. We'll see it from a season. We haven't spoken about the chapel in the west wall. We'll bring up the the line line. and increase the cost. Naturally, once we complete the facade, we'll deal with the front. We'll begin with the reinforcement, but... What, what is it? Hey. Hey.